Yo guys, it's Gaming Recruit, and today we've got a video on the new, um, or not the new, the Pick'em Challenge for the Clone 2015 tournament, and it's been happening, it happened last year as well, it's pretty awesome, so if you haven't done it before, I'm going to go for a quick walk through, it's pretty simple, so what you do is, you go get stickers, and you go to team stickers, um, I'll talk, talk about the player ones after this, but, so you say there's four groups, um, with different teams in it, so let's say we want to, um, pick Fnatic for that group, we're going to say they're going to win, we go to watch, and we go to pick'em challenge, um, play the pick'em challenge, and you see they're in group C, and out of these four teams, you pick who's going to win, you buy that sticker, and it's, which is a dollar fifty, a uh, fifty in New Zealand, which is like 90 cents American, so it's pretty cheap. Um, all you do is uh, you click on that team and it'll say either you, if you've already got the sticker, you say make them my pick, or if you haven't bought the sticker, it will just say buy sticker, which is a dollar fifty, um, pretty cheap to be honest. And you don't lose the sticker, I'm pretty sure you don't lose the sticker once you bet it, or well, I sort of like betting it, but you're not really betting it. But yeah, you're betting on the team. I don't know if you lose a sticker or not, I'm pretty certain you don't. Please tell me if I'm wrong or not, but I'm pretty sure you don't. But anyway, you click on that team and you picked them. Or pick that team out of the four. So you're you're gonna you're gonna say this team's gonna win in this group. Um, and yeah, it's pretty simple. I've chosen um, TSM for the group A, to Team Kinging, uh, Fnatic, and Cloud9. Uh, I think that's pretty solid. TSM or Ninjas will probably win, but I chose TSM and I did Team Kinging and then Fnatic is pretty easy. Or maybe Titan. I'm not sure, but I, I chose Fnatic. It's a pretty you know easy one to pick, and then Cloud9. And yeah, it's pretty simple. And 50% of all the things you like, the stickers you buy, actually go, the proceeds go to, um, they go to the the players and the organization. So that yeah, supports the players and organizations that are doing this for you, like the clone. I think some of it goes to clone, and the rest of it goes to the players, which is pretty awesome. The next thing you have to do for this one is you pick a player that has for for the first day um, highest. Headshot percentage, I did random, okay, because the reason is I just opened the, the capsule things and I just chose that person because otherwise, because it's actually really expensive. Like I would have, pro obviously, if I got X, or I would have chosen, where is it, on Team King, I would have chosen Scream, but he's like $5, and I'm not spending $5 on one sticker, it's not worth it. Um, I really just want to try to get for bronze, I don't really care, you only need 25 to get bronze, and you actually get 2 points every day, um, every day, so you get, you can pretty much get enough point. you can almost get halfway through of the points to get bronze without even, you know, betting, so hopefully I get at least bronze, it'll be pretty cool if I at least get bronze, but I don't want to spend $5 on, um, Scream sticker, but we're going to actually open some capsules, but yeah, it's pretty easy. The next day you have to choose for the most kills, second day, most pistol kills, and then the, on day, f what is it, three? Day three you have to pick, um, no, day four, sorry, day four you have to pick the kill death ratio, so, for the finals, which is pretty simple, and yeah, it's just, I don't know what happens here, I haven't seen it, but it's, you, you, once you know how to do this, you know, you'll know how to do these, I haven't seen it, but we'll find out when the matches are live. Um, so let's open some sticky capsules. I don't know if I should open some autograph ones or I can't really afford these. I'm not rich enough guys. So I'm going to buy, um, some autograph stickers. I'm going to buy, let's buy one ninjas and pajamas. I've already got $7. So I'm poor. Okay guys, I'm poor. Well, I'm not poor, but I just, I just can't afford all of them. I want to get scream. Hopefully if I can get scream, I'll be very happy. And we've got some, I'm going to try buy who else? We'll just buy some random ones. Let's buy... Um, Fnatic, cool, okay, and then let's buy Renegades, because I like the Renegades, they're not too bad, I think we can buy one more after this, can we, I don't think we can actually, can we, can we, can we, no, I don't think we can, let's see, no we can't, damn it, well we can't buy any more, just off a bit, I might buy some, but anyway, let's open these, I got a Titan one as well, didn't open that yet, so let's open the Fnatic one, see how it goes, let's see if we can get Olive Meister or uh, JW, which would be pretty cool, JW, come on, no, Pronex is pretty good, but I think JW is really expensive, I'm not sure, I haven't checked, we'll see how much Pronex costs later on, uh, we want to, obviously want to get right, or maybe Forest, I think those are the two coolest, Forest's signature looks sick, 
And we get Aliu. Not bad. He's an awesome player. Um, but I... Okay, I want to get... Um, oh, I, I want to get Scream, obviously. That's really hard to get. But if I get Scream, I'm rich. Five bucks. I'm so rich, guys. I'm so rich, you know. And we get Sponge. I think that's how you pronounce it. I'm not too soon, but I think it's Sponge. That's pretty awesome. And let's hopefully get... No, we'll do that one last. Um, we probably want Shocks. Because I've, I've got Smiths, and Smiths is worth nothing. But Shocks, I think, is the most expensive in um, Titan. Come on, no. we got RPK, though, which is pretty nice. And the mighty Scream we want in this one. And we get Rain. Oh, that's not too bad. Rain's pretty good. Oh, we're one off Scream, of course. Troll me again. Um, well... Not too bad, we've got some pretty cool stickers. I like the signatures. Um, I think, I don't know what they look like. Let's see what they look like on guns, because we've actually never tried it. Oh god, why is that white there? I don't know, it's not usually white. But yeah, it looks pretty cool, I guess. They're, I thought they'd be a lot bigger on the gun, but they're actually not too big. They just look really big when you look at them, I don't know. I just thought they'd be a lot bigger, which is not the best. But anyway, guys, hope you liked the video. Hopefully you know how to do this pick'em challenge now. Um... Anyway guys, thanks for watching, peace.